Hey guys, my name is Reza. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I just passed Microsoft Azure Administrator exam and I'm just gonna show you guys how to become an Azure Administrator. Let's start. I'm gonna talk about three things. How much time I spent for this exam, what kind of resources I've used and some tips and tricks to help you guys to pass the exam. How much time I spent? I've spent around two months, roughly two hours every day. And number two, what kind of resources I've used? I used Microsoft Learn Portal as the main resource. Okay, if you browse to Microsoft Portal and if you search for exam AZ104, you will find this page. I will put the link of the all websites that I use in this video in the description area okay if you go to Microsoft portal and if you search AZ104 you will see the main topics that evaluate your skills against this certification you can download the exam skills outline and find the detailed area of these of each topics and it's a prerequisite for Azure administrator and it will cover the, the basics of the Azure. There are some other um, learning paths as well, like, like uh, Azure AD, um, storage, compute resources, networking, Azure monitor and backup for resources. This certification is not about just only passing the exam. It's just, it is not about reading and studying. So for this, I would recommend before starting the reading and studying, go through Microsoft Ignite YouTube channel and find this uh, this link. They haven't provided AZ-104 as Ignite yet, but the concept of this video is the same as 104. So you can go through this video and find out from these chaps. They provide some good advice and suggestions. So if you study for, if you start studying from Learn Portal, for example, I'm just going to provide you some tips here. If you find, for example, this page and important items and you, you want to review them in future again before your exam, you can click on bookmarks. You can bookmark it. And if you go to your bookmarks, you will see your bookmark here. Once you read and cleared it, you can delete it. I had more than 100 bookmarks here two or three days prior my, my exam. I cleared them all. One other thing that uh, during the study you may you may do is I've done that this one. You can copy and paste some of the most important items and create one note for yourself. For example, I created for each and every module separate page. Um, this will this will help you prior your exam to review your notes. If you study these modules from Microsoft Learn Portal. And if you want to help yourself to, to understand it better, I would suggest go to the, some learning providers. One, one of the best one for me was um, Scott Duffy from Udemy. I, I bought the package and it was quite helpful for me. It's around 12 hours training with 28 articles, some downloadable resources, and some quizzes. I highly recommend this one. You may use CBT Nuggets, Cloud Academy, Linux Academy. There are a bunch of other res uh, service provide learning service providers, but I would suggest this one. So if you watch these videos, if you learn Microsoft Learn Portal, still you need to interactively engage yourself with Azure services. That's why I suggest definitely please go through portal.azure.com, create a profile for yourself and you can use Azure free trial, which will give you 200 free credits. And you can create a VM. You can familiarize yourself with different um, virtual networking services. You can create point to point to site uh, connection from your laptop to Azure VNet. Um, you can create a storage, you can back up resources, you can recover, uh, restore them or take a snapshot. You need to have some hands-on experience. Okay, 
Now let's start to number three. Um, you can use WizLabs portal, AZ104 page. It has 220 questions and it's got five different packages. If you clear them above 80%, I would say you are the default for the main exam. There is also a portal called exam topics. You can search for AZ104 and you can go through the questions. There is only one point here that the answers might not be correct. You need to go to the discussion tab and find the resources from Microsoft portal. All right, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please click on subscribe button and make sure to enable all notifications. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time.